Hey guys, Herbal Prepper here, and today I wanted to show you what wild lobelia looks like. Um, I've already done a video on the uses for uh, lobelia. Um, if you've not uh, watched that, you can go back and watch that. But it's a it's a uh, a remedy that's used for the uh, lungs, so it's been known. Uh, to help people quit smoking and things like that. It's very useful. Um, it does have strong emetic properties, so that's why a lot of people think it's poisonous. But it's not poisonous, it's just highly medicinal. Um, so here it is, guys. So if you look at the, the pattern of the petals, you notice there's three on the bottom and two on the top. It's kind of like a violet in a way that it hangs over. Let me see if I can, there we go. Um, the, the three petals on the bottom there with the two on the top. That and its stalk, each one of these would be a flower. And each one of these holds many tiny, tiny seeds. Let me see if I can see those little in there, the little black on my hand there. All those are seeds. So basically, if you wanna collect the seeds, you just take your hand, run up like this, and you will have a ton of tiny, tiny seeds. These are extremely small. And then uh, guys, what you do from here is you just take it and put it in like a paper towel or whatever until you get it home. And um, Because if not, they will blow away. But they're so small, they kind of stick to your skin just because you know your sweat or your natural oils. But, um, but it's very easy to grow. As you can see, it kind of grows in, you know, clayish type ground, full sun. Um, and typically when it grows, it will um, produce a bunch of these, you know, little stalks here. So it's not hard to grow at all. So if you're looking to grow it um, and you want a wild variety as opposed to going and buying something like from Walmart or wherever you choose to buy your plants from, <clears throat> you can uh, just come out and harvest the seeds. Like I say, guys, they have tons. Look at all the little black specks inside. Let me zoom out some. All of that is packed full of seeds. So they just kind of bust open. And when they bust open, um, they spread. And so, uh, guys, real quick ways to use this. You could just cut the material down, take it home with you, put it in a tincture. You can use the seeds as a tincture. Um, but guys, go back and review my, uh, my video on using Lobelia because it is going to be uh, pretty informative and um, now you just know what it looks like. So take the two videos together and uh, that should give you enough information and confidence to be able to go out and harvest it yourself and use it. So guys, this is Lobelia. Until next time, I hope the video is a blessing.